Feng Shui Art for Home, 17 Things to Consider for Abundance A Feng Shui art or another type of Feng Shui painting is often a good choice for our apartment's interior. It may be used to accent the overall decor, including wall colors, drapes, even furnishings. Canvases and perhaps other works of art in vivid colors could be used as additions inside the interior decoration if you utilize bright shades. As a result, beautiful art pieces are constantly in great request to brighten up our homes. Considering choosing Feng Shui art for certain regions within your house, there really are a couple of different Feng Shui standards to keep in mind. Regarding Feng Shui, what is the relevance of painting? Feng Shui artworks might assist you in repairing flaws within your four directions as well as attracting prosperity and success. Once you select the correct type of paintings, this would assist to shift the energy throughout your area as well as assist carry in best wishes and wealth. The bar ga is divided into sections, each having its own set of components, colors, and pictures. Much of the Feng Shui Bar Ga concept corresponds to our modern understanding of what shades and pictures represent. 5 Feng Shui Elements and Paintings Works of art, typically performed within Feng Shui, reflect the five fundamental elements, fire, earth, metal, water, as well as wood. Numerous people think that these components regulate the transmission of good as well as unfavorable forces. As a result, components should consistently be in harmony in order to preserve a steady environment. Metal. Many appreciate paintings of cars, money, and silver personal care sets given their capacity to perk up a living area as well as provide an awareness of pristine housekeeping. It could bump up your effectiveness also enable you to handle anxiety properly. Fire. Experts frequently integrate fire-inspired works of art with high-energy environments because usually convey comfort as well as enthusiasm. Wood. Feng Shui wood component, the same as earth Feng Shui paintings, provides you plus your friends and family's development as well as wealth. Earth. Earth shades encourage wellness as well as longevity, and they serve as a decent bedrock for the growth of your household as well as interpersonal relations. Water. Water's calmness could help to relieve tension or offer the ideal environment enabling you to rest as well as rejuvenate. Water sceneries, creeks, waterfalls, lagoons, and perhaps other fluids are associated with prospective riches and success inside the precepts of Feng Shui. How to choose colors for paintings in Feng Shui? Feng Shui tones may alter the ambience as well as the feel of your house, however, it is deeper beyond merely helping a place seem nicer. Feng Shui is not an interior decoration approach or aesthetic, despite popular belief. It is very much artistry but also a philosophy, with the goal of regulating and harmonizing, which would eventually enhance your own energy rates. For illustration, when you intend to attract good fortune, choose the tone purple, since it has an ancient legacy of having linked with divine power, monarchy, as well as the perceptive parietal eye. A further feng shui hue for extreme wealth is green when decorating. Gold, as well as silver, are typically symbols of prosperity. Whereas black denotes the water component. Regarding feng shui, water simply implies riches. What different seasons depict in Feng Shui painting? Autumn seasons The autumn seasons of September, October, through November are directly intertwined with the metal Feng Shui component. Warmer period, such as April, May, through June, summer periods, are strongly connected with the earth component of Feng Shui. Summer season The onset of the summer season corresponds to the Feng Shui component of fire. Cold season's Feng Shui water components are equally attributed with December through January, cold seasons. Spring periods Wood's Feng Shui component corresponds to the spring periods, February and March. What lines and patterns meaning in Feng Shui art? Regarding Feng Shui, lines can also be vital, especially this covers ones in works of art. 
Since adverse chi flows in something like a linear manner, linear lines plus precise arcs are deemed unlucky or unfavorable. Linear lines could be used in pieces of art, but they must be eased using bends and arcs. Since good vibes flow in a bent route, bent lines have been shown to be beneficial. The stability and oscillations of energy with the surroundings are indicated utilizing circles. Positive Feng Shui Images in Paintings Since the Chinese term for fish directly corresponds to plenty, the Feng Shui fish paintings signify riches and success. Seeing as fish reproduce quickly and occasionally travel in couples, fish drawings typically reflect marital pleasure, concord, and procreation. Furthermore, the works of art of horses or seven running horses painting somewhat on south side offer renown notoriety, and glory, movement, and advancement, as well as consistent and rapid rise in reputation with achievements in profession and existence. Buddha imagery, either sculptures or paintings, convey auspicious fortune. The lotus blossom denotes divine self-control, finesse, and trust. The lotus blossom is often utilized as a sign of medical cure throughout Feng Shui. Inspiring imagery, including gorgeous natural landscape or festivities, are painted on canvas and spread good thoughts across your house or business. Negative Feng Shui Images in Paintings Birds typically indicative of divine luck throughout Feng Shui, however other Feng Shui artworks depict a hawk or an eagle pursuing birds even a well crow perched on a dry tree. Individuals over sceneries will offer a massive amount of cash to purchase a nice Feng Shui poster and place it for best wishes. The picture depicts an unbalanced Feng Shui flow featuring deformed representations of vegetation, desiccated trees, rough weather, gloomy sky, and heavy rains. Painting sizes and materials. You don't even have to hang artworks upon each surface within your house. The house must be allowed to air and allow qi life essence power to circulate. Take into reflection, the width and length of your house or the spot to which you are introducing images. Ensure that paintings isn't too large and weighty for the room, since this might obstruct the movement of qi. What are the best Feng Shui painting positions? Regarding business regions, scenery painting, scenery images are suitable for a Feng Shui office art pieces, a image for the residential workplace, or a drawing for a simple region wherein you operate. Water works of art in the forefront. Throughout Feng Shui, water signifies prosperity. Oil canvases depicting waterfalls, waterways, even rivers may be magnificent at occasions. Feng Shui art of animals. Introducing feral creatures within the home may throw the energy patterns of the place into disarray. When they're in a foul disposition, they could even flip upon their masters. If one must retain them, seek a location to display them outside. Fields with no barriers, the luminous space wherein energy as well as natural energies congregate is symbolized by imagery and artworks of vast fields. Which paintings to hang above the bed Feng Shui? Somewhat on the pinnacle of an individual's head seems to be a highly significant chakra. A Feng Shui artwork hung above a headboard would have an immediate effect upon that. The handcrafted two-fold happiness decor inscription seems to have a hand-rubbed gloomy hardwood appearance. Display this monument above the bed. Art pieces of the dragon as well as phoenix, one more great as well as strong icon of matrimony, dragon with phoenix may be utilized as a custom monument or a further kind of drawings. Portraits of raging waterways, gushing torrents, even cascading waterfalls could disturb the room's energy balance. Which Feng Shui works of art should you have in your master bedroom? A silk handcrafted artwork of magnolia blooms accompanying a couple of birds would be a lovely option. Exquisite borders are recommended while selecting Feng Shui artwork for master bedroom. Displaying lovely floral portraits, such as a feng shui painting of lilies inside the bedroom, helps revitalize connections. Where to place blue paintings feng shui? Blue does have many feng shui connotations according to the intensity. The wood component, 
for instance, is expressed by mid-tone blues as well as teals. Specific hues of blue have been identified with sorrow in various Asian traditions. Blue is strongly correlated with happiness within Buddhism, as depicted via the lapis-colored health Buddha. Koi fish paintings Feng Shui In certain Feng Shui opinions, there are numerous fortunate motifs or creatures, then fish have always been among them. If you want to adorn your home with Feng Shui wall art that have a positive connotation, koi fish paintings are an excellent alternative. What type of Feng Shui art should be on the east side of the house? Vigor Feng Shui posters are advised for the eastern side since they provide good vibes. Feng Shui images of woods, wildlife, people, perhaps just your own household photographs might be used. What is geomancy? Geomancy is very much a historical technique that involves the application of almanacs, amulets, and sophisticated gauges to help individuals, respective living places, as well as the environmental world synchronize overall relations. Principles of Taoism as foundation for art of Feng Shui, Taoist art is inspired by Lao Taoist Su's concept, which encourage experiencing life, authentically, and then in unison with the natural environment. The qualities of the beauty of nature are frequently depicted in Taoist scenery drawings as inspirations for humankind. Art of Feng Shui is a technique for harmonizing yin with yang while enhancing qi circulation by strategically placing furnishings, paintings, imagery, and sometimes even entire houses. Feng Shui art pieces that you enjoy and that have pleasant imagery through which you relate or desire to connect can assist you in achieving your ambitions. Each moment you glance at the imagery, you are made aware of the sentiments and sensations you have connected with it. When the artwork manages to render you joyful and satisfied the first moment you encounter it, watching it repeatedly would reaffirm existing sensations thus contributing to making you delighted and satisfied once more. Thanks for watching the video. If you loved the video feel free to hit the like button. And if you are new to the channel do not forget to subscribe the channel. Also follow us on different social media platforms in order to stay updated.